Next stop on the Traxxas Truck Series brings us to <coughs> the Pig Speed Dome. It is the <coughs> new one of the new tracks on the Traxxas Truck Series circuit. So no need to worry about rain since you're in a Speed Dome. <coughs> yep, it's a Tracker Tracker Boats 175. <coughs> Excuse me. On the bulb for today's event, it's Nancy Sultave, number 32, alongside of her, David Chung, in 08. Row 2 has Luke Walker, number 7, and Joel McDowell, in the number 1. Row number 3 has Nicholas Guerrero, in the 33, and 23 of Chris Dartson. Row 4 has Jeannie Sanford, in the 22, and the 09 of Cheyenne Claus, in the row number 5, has the 07 of Maddie Card, and the 81 of Roy Vanderview. Row number 6 Adrian Becker in the 10 and the 30 of Jeremy Soltave. And here comes the command to fire him up here at the Speed Dome. Drivers, start your engines! Man, give him the fire of the engines as the field about ready to get set for some, um, thir for 27 laps of short track madness here at the Pig Speed Dome. We saw how wild the race it was in a nationwide series a little earlier in the year. So, points bat and the points battles could take a turn for the could take a turn for the better or for worse, whichever. So we'll see what happens. Is the green flag about to come down? And here we go. Here at the big speed down. Nancy Sultan gets a good start on the on the field. David Chung of high. Luke Walker dives inside for the number two position. And three wide coming out of the turn. I see Maddie Card going inside of Chris Darton and David Chung. Nicholas Guerrero moving up into third position. Maddie Card up to fourth. Are trying for third now inside of Nicholas Guerrero. Lead still being held by Nancy Soltave at number 32. Checking out some of the trucks in the back of the field. Theo Stegall in the 11 trying to, trying to go up inside of the 03 of Sam Young. And he and Sam touch just a little bit coming out of the turn. And now he dives inside of the 13 of John Acosta. Now Terry Soltave in the 31 inside of Maya Clark in the 18 and the 8 of Charles Jackson. And all four wide in turn number one in turn number three. This track luckily is wide enough for that to, for that there. Most short tracks aren't. That's Charles Jackson and Cheyenne Claus doing a little repping and bumping there. Just a little bit. Steven Acosta, meanwhile, inside of the 22 of Jeannie Sanfer for position. Joshua Osborne moving his way up through the field. He's one of the points contenders. He's up in the sixth position now. Actually, he's in the top ten points chase in tenth place. The defending Truck Series champion. Won the last short track race on the tour at Bristol, Tennessee. As he gets by the one of Joel McDowell. And now has David Chung in 0-8 right behind him in seventh. Osborne up in the sixth place and moving up on the 17 of Taylor Acosta, who won who's won a race this season as well. Adrian Becker up in fourth place in the driving for Jennifer Joe Cobb Racing in the 10 truck. The driven to honor Ford. And you're riding on board with Adrian. And boy, look at that tachometer. And let's look at the tachometer on this truck here. As the, as the, as, and I tell you, they turn RPMs like to the max on this track. That just passed 10,000 RPMs going into the turn. That's RPM, that's RPMs to the max here at Pick Speed Dome.
Vector up in the fourth position now. So that tells me the the engines they use at MMB Motorsports <coughs> have just monster RPMs and monster horsepower. As you see, Nancy Sultan come up on the lap truck of Gavin Furry in the four. Whoa! Nancy uh, decided not to use the bumper on him, but now she's got Luke Walker on the inside of the seven. And oh! Walker leaning up on the back member, just letting Cheyenne Kloss in the third place position. Letting in, in the race as Luke Walker dives inside for the lead. And boy, some short track action going on. Three wide in the turn number one. And now Adrian Becker in the 10 truck. Ooh! She gets back, she gets by Maddie Card and Nancy Soltave. And now Becker's going to try her luck at. The, at the seven of Luke Walker, and now Walker's gonna have the lead in the seven truck for Red Horse Racing, as he now has 12 laps to go here in this pig speed dome. Toyota in first place position, Ford, Ford in second, uh, Chevrolet in third. Ten laps to go for Luke Walker. We'll check the lap speeds this time by, see if Adrian Becker's closing in any on Luke Walker. Walker this time by runs a lap of 108.036 for Luke Walker. Adrian at 108.000. So, about just relatively even trucks for those two. Although Luke Walker has a slightly faster truck than Adrian Becker does. We'll check it again as we have, now have eight laps to go. So no lap traffic to bear for either truck. Surprisingly, we've gone caution free here to speed down. We had a a cautions breed cautions race uh, in the nationwide race. So not so much of the trucks. The trucks have kept it relatively clean here in the tracker boats. One seventy five. Adrian Becker runs second position. There's Nancy Solte running third. Joshua Osborne up in the fourth place now in a 62 truck. The South Point Toyota for Brendan Gunn. David Chung running fifth position. Six is Taylor Acosta in a 17. Robbie Bogues running an eight, <coughs> running seventh. Eighth is Joel McDowell. And the pace truck is on the track. It looks to me like no cause for the caution flag, so... And all that, and all those green flag laps, and we got the one caution that lasted with five, less than five laps to go. Incredible. So that's going to mean your winner of the race is going to be the 7 of Luke Walker as he will win today in the Tracker Votes 175. Talk about an anticlimactic ending to this event. Just, I don't know. So there it is, kind of the turn. Luke Walker in a number 7 truck for Red Horse Racing gets a win here today. There it is, Luke Walker wins today here in a pig speed dome. What the heck? What in the world's a truck wrong with that pace truck? It's hitting the wall. Is it hitting the wall on purpose or In the heck? Oh. 
Okay. I want to see what's going on here. Seems like to me like the pace car or the pace truck does weird things at the speed dome. Watch this. Pace truck's on drugs. I don't know. I think the pace truck's on drugs. But this... I'll turn this thing down. This is really... I don't know. Average speed 84, 762. Their Lick Walker wins the race here today. Second was Adrian Becker. Third was Nancy Solte. Fourth, Joshua Osborne. Fifth place was David Chung. Sixth was... Uh, Taylor Acosta, then Robbie Bogues, Joel McDowell, Stephen Acosta, and Maddie Card finishing in 10th place. Then Chris Dalton, Dylan Young, Nicholas Guerrera, uh, Terry Soltave, Charles Jackson, Cheyenne Kloss, Jeannie Sanford, Roy Vanderview, Mike Becker, and Maya Clark, the top uh, 20 in this event. Then rest, there's all the way down to 28th position. There's the finishing order, rest of the finishing order for you. This is crazy. So, big win for the number seven truck. It is Luke Walker taking the win here today at the Pig Speed Dome. Here's your points. They are after 21 races. Cheyenne Kloss with a 36 point lead on Nancy Soltave. Mike Becker, 59 back in third. Alex Heinz, 91 back in fourth. And then Theo Stegall, fifth place in the points. Sixth is. Joshua Osborne, he's moved up in the points. Then Maya Clark, Maddie Card, Adrian Becker, and David Chung, the top 10. Taylor Acosta down 20th in the points. So, and then there's the rest of the points they are right now. Uh, yeah. Next race on the tour will be a Kentucky Speedway for the Ram Tuth 225.